So I'm dead to a fireball. A fireball. No name, no name, but I am dead in my base, okay? I'm gonna spawn outside first and foremost, okay? Anytime that I'm dead inside my base, I always like to approach it from the outside despite my home bag just now being there. Wait, I'm looking in the group and there's only three of us left. Holy crap, okay. So first things first, we have a wood base down there with my logo on a sign, okay? Then we come up here and I have 10 hours of upkeep. Okay, okay. Wait, wait where did I log out at though exactly? What's this guy's name? Tanika. Love the vids. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, I'm going to have one kill. Spawn inside my vault real quick. Um, dude, I don't know how I died. What the heck? I swore that I logged down inside, and if I died to a... It said fireball. Are people using destruction spells, and they hit me with the fireball cast, or what? I think that someone tried to raid me, but the zapper, like, deflected their boom. Oh, and I see what's his name. Morning, sir. How's life? <laughs> Lillian, what the hell am I hearing right now? How's life? I mean, things were checking in, but, I mean... Good morning. Life is solid. How are you doing? Yeah. I mean, it's like life is like, a, I don't know. Like, I don't know. With me, it's weird because like, I'm still obviously very young. So my pers, you know, like my perspective of life is still being built and whatnot. But uh, because like there's this side of me that tells me, okay, I know life is an absolute blessing, which, which honestly I think that it is. But at the same time within our culture, I feel like it's like a gift and a curse. Like it's weird. I mean, that's the yin yang. It's just like a balance, right? It's a balance of good and bad. I'm going to go over to cargo now and most likely be disappointed because uh, someone may not even be here yet. <laughs> so, it's so Lillian asked me, uh, morning, sir, how's life? And I said, good morning, life is solid, how you doing? Awesome, I'm great. Another beautiful rust morning, lol. Okay, Lillian, you are on top of the world. You are on cloud nine right now, man. It is a beautiful rust morning, okay? I'm seeing bots all over this thing. Yep, I'm not going here. I'm not going here. I'm really just wanting to counter people. Like, me taking cargo alone right now, it's like, it's not really something that I care to do. See him say, your base okay? Boat base got hit. <laughs> I wonder how much stuff he kept in the boat base, because I was worried about that. Stream snipers may have just raided it. Yeah, my base is fine, thankfully. What did you end up doing with all that loot? Wait, and I see Lillian say, hid most of it. <laughs> That's good. Okay, so there's this base right here, and I'm a little bit confused, because this is the one with the wood barricade next to it. I raided this thing yesterday through the front door. Front sheet door, and it was only one door. Now there's a new wood door on it, and then there's a double wood door on top. Are you telling me that they picked the floor out and put that up there? Because there was no top door on this thing before. There was none of this top shit. It was just one level with a sheet door, and then I raided it. Okay, alright, I got a flame right in. Here we go. Okay, so pretty much 250 crude oil. Uh, 750 wood, probably a little bit too much wood, but whatever, I'm not worried about it. Oh, and the oil refinery base, it's gone. <laughs> Fuck. That's my fault. I was the one that didn't keep up keeping it, and because I because I made it for both of us and gave us both, the, like, the code for it, but I sealed up TC with a strengthened glass window, and he never got TC before that, so, he, uh, if, like, if he saw it decaying, he couldn't really do anything. Is there even going to be anything in here? I don't know if... Yeah, he picked out a floor. Okay. Like, say what? Okay. I mean... How much of this loot is just going to be loot from yesterday that was in here already? Oh. 600 sulfur, I mean. Shit, okay. I'll take that. Base. Look right here. Bullshit. 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 Oh, we'll see this inside, TC. TC actually could be solid. All right, what all do we got? Hey, I'll take that. Give me that fucking wood, baby. And I need to keep my eyes on oil rig, man, because yesterday someone took it and I didn't even realize it. I do think to myself, like, with my area just being a ghost town, I wonder if I should, uh... Dude, this shit feels so laggy, man. I'm at 48 FPS. Yeah, like, as I was saying, uh, with my area being a ghost town and whatnot, for the most part, I do think, huh, should I just, like, take the transit over toward Outpost and just see if, like, there's a shitload of action over there? Oh, shit. Oh. Dude, this is one of these bases. Would this be a main base and a farm at the same time? Like, I don't know. I have no, I, 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 yeah, I just now got comforts. So, like, there's, like, a bear rug or something in there, which is not some shit that you put down inside of a farm base. I'm just gonna mark this shit just because it's in like the middle of nowhere. And I'll probably come over here and just 2C4 in and just see where we get. We have a lot of boom to work with. I'm hearing a horse with armor on in there. Oh yeah, I got the military man door. Oh yeah, older man Joe lives here. Him and his horsey. 
I mean, there's wanted posters up right there. Oh, yeah, dude. This guy, yeah. Arcade. Wicked good value. T-Shop. Hey, you know what? Here, I'll play the chippy machine. I, I, just so we all know, I've never played this shit. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, okay, okay. I'm on level two. Yeah, like, I've never done this before. Yeah, I'm on level three. What level have you guys got to? Is this, like, a thing that people do? Yeah, nah, I give up. This game's too easy. It's too easy. Oh my god, dude, I'm telling you this guy. Oh shit, man. Fuck. Why could they not fly lower right there? Actually, it does look like they're about to land over there, maybe. One minute here. I'm gonna go over here and see if I can fight these guys, maybe. Bam, man, freaking Joe with the shoddy trap, man. What the fuck, Joe? Oh, it's just another one of these big-ass teams that has a village. Here we go. Here we go at the 20 windmill base. Oh, shit. Where is that guy going? I don't know, man. He's getting really high up there, though. I'm actually starting to believe that the only people that are on this server are just bigger teams that live in big bases. And, like, then you have, like, 20% of the server that's just, like, solo players. I'm going to get inside here and get 2C4, and I'm going to go raid that one farm base that we ended up seeing. I wish that I could have fought those guys back there, but, I mean, live in a big compound and only leave your base on a minicopter, and you don't don't have to worry about a thing, usually, you know, so. Anyone over at Oil Rig yet? No, sir. I see someone comment, you did upgrade your headset mic some years ago, and it, so it's not your first time. So, okay, so yesterday I said that I'm getting a whole new mic set up, right? But you have to realize, okay, I've had the same headset type throughout all this time. I did, I did upgrade my headset but it didn't actually change the quality of the microphone. It's like the same microphone, pretty much. Just a newer generation of it. And it's like, not that different at all. So, yeah, I'm just gonna boom into this back spot right here, and we're just gonna see where this goes. I mean, might be embarrassing. We might cry a little bit, but that's okay, right? <coughs> it's completely okay. See, look at this. Oh my god, what is this? Eh, there is some god clones in here for hemp. I think those are god clones, at least. We're in a little bit of a weird predicament. I didn't even know that you could make a farm base on floors like this. What the f- I'm just gonna throw that there. Okay, yeah, so he lives over here. Like, over here is, like, his main- Okay, no, wait. What the fuck is this base? I'm actually so confused, like, where TC's at and shit. Got this here. Okay, I got all that cloth and a Tommy. Okay. I want to say that it might be behind that hard side stone wall, but behind but behind that hard side stone wall is this door. So like, okay, what the fuck does that mean? I don't know. Maybe I actually should just go through that door and just see where it leads us. See this one comment? Prawn pasta sounds like shrimp pasta. LMAO. Yeah, like I never heard of the word prawn before, but I'm also like not into seafood really, so I guess that that might be why. I don't know. All right, we back, we back. So pretty much. They got this, 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 this. Do I have any GP inside of here already? Yes, I do. Okay, I know we're good. Yeah, I'm just going to make 64 expo for that door. We'll see what's behind it. I'm not expecting to see much here. I'm not getting my hopes up too high for this, though. <coughs> yep, the morning sneezes are here. Here we go. All right. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's going to be behind that door. For sure. TC's definitely behind that door. I am debating with myself, like, huh, should this be the last day on this server? Because the lack of PvP definitely fucking sucks, like, without a doubt. Like, I'm not happy about it. Like, no one's going to oil rig anymore, so it's not even a water wipe. I'm just raiding now, right? And, like, raiding's cool. I enjoy it, but this was meant to be a water wipe, though. But yet again, I don't know, because tomorrow's the start of the weekend. So tomorrow, the server could be looking better, because everyone's going to be on later. Everyone's going to be just playing more in general. Yeah, let's go ahead and get inside here, and let's, let's raid this thing. Let's go. Oh. Okay, it's okay. We carry grenades on us, guys. Okay, everything's fine. I mean, I don't know how that ammo wasn't enough, but okay. Okay, so it's 1,300 sulfur, 800 frags. Got this guy right here, Andre. Uh, simple component box. Random box, kinda. Okay. I have a solid feeling about this, TC. I do feel like it's gonna be full all the way. Question is... What all do we got? Eh, a little bit of goodies, I'll take it. I think that, I don't know, I'm thinking about taking a trip over to, like, uh, buy Outpost. 
Just to see if I can find any PvP there, because my area, it's just, it's, it's dead as fuck. Alright, we back. Oil rig, anybody there yet? Nope. No one cares to go oil now, Dylan. No one cares to go oil, so you can't even, you can't even have your water wipe anymore. I mean, like, we had some fun out there. We had some dubs, right? But man, dude, now it's just, it's just going too slow out there. But, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and take out, like... All this stone here, I'm going to take out this wood and this wood and I guess this wood right here as well. Probably a little bit of cloth I'll take. By the way, very quick shout out to Dylan Medler in the comments. He ended up donating $50 and I read that whole message. Thank you very much for that. I ended up sending you a bit of a response uh, to your uh, message. But thank you very much for that $50 and uh, glad to hear that you're doing better, man. seeing a big base to my left right now, which is not the best of feelings, but whatever. Can I base right here? Ah, uh, too close to outpost still. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, Dylan, you thought that your area was like, get ready for the outpost area. This is where all your fantasies come true. Of paddlers, bad FPS, stinky nutsacks. This is actually insane. Dude, I cannot find a place to live around outpost. Just no spots. Is this spot right here taken? I mean, I see an external back there, but... Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, okay. Okay, cool, there we go. Now I'm just gonna make one more sheet door, okay. One more key lock. TC will go down there, plop down that. Garage door, that right there. Tier two, right there. There we go. Okay, okay, we have had we have got a base down over here. Cool. I mean, I mean I'm happy that I live right on the train tracks, because now I can just park my transit like right there whenever I want. Then we can just leave our base, get inside the transit, and dip with all the loot. Because yeah, like, yeah, the plan. I'm coming over here to get more PvP because the PvP in my area sucks donkey balls, so we're over here to have some fun now. Naked just sitting right there inside of Outpost. Has the guy just running right there. <sighs> Why does everyone have to live around this fucking place? I've got this guy here, full metal, sitting here all day selling fertilizer. Got the Hazzy guy sitting here all day. Naked Tommy guy logged out. This is where he lives. Who cares, right guys? Just live at Outpost. But now I'm just thinking, okay, is there anyone on the outside of Outpost that I can fight? Or is everyone just hiding inside there? Oh, man. Dylan, I don't know if you should be putting yourself in this position around Outpost. Because it's going to be annoying with people constantly hugging this shit. I see Lillian say your low grade is in the TC next to the bubbler, sir. Okay, thanks. I forgot about it. It's really fucking quiet, and I don't like this shit. Yep, got the geared guy here sitting here still just buying fertilizer. Got the guy sitting here AFK on a horse. Like, why, dude? Why? I just not heard a train show up to outpost. Oh shit, no, nine low grade left. Dylan, I don't know if this guy's actually going to be coming back here. I think that you're just, like, sitting here for no reason. Oh, my God, guys. Oh, my God. I cannot get PvP in this game. Like, it doesn't matter what the fuck I do. I can come over here to Outpost. It doesn't matter, man. It doesn't matter. I'm leaving, man. I, I can't do this. All right, I'm out of here. Oh. Okay. I was what is happening right now? Okay. I was going to say, I thought that my game was going to crash. I'm shocked that it, that it didn't right there. Okay. Whoa. I, I'm seeing encoding overloaded right now on my OBS. Hopefully everything's fine. And someone took oil rig and I didn't realize. Oh my god, I'm pissed. Dude, I'm looking at my fucking OBS, man. That shit is lagging. Oh my god. What's going on with my shit right now? Season 1 comment, Dylan. Why the fuck did you not put the zapper down before you got raided? You could have exploded everyone. Oh, I could have zapped everyone to death. I mean, there is a self-destructive mode on it, though. Like, there is like a... A mode on it where it's like, okay, there's too much going on, I can't do anything, then it's like an electrical explosion, then it crashes their PCs, it puts viruses into their systems, and, and then they're fucked. But, uh, yeah, I wasn't thinking, obviously, so. The silly goosery continues. Yeah, just get that right there going now. Okay. So pretty much, how much tech trash am I sitting on? Oh god, dude, I hope that I have tech trash still. Oh no. And it's like, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I could just go and... 
recycle some shit to get more. Like, I have two laptops just right here. Dude, I don't know. Wait, I swore that I had more tech trash. Another laptop here. What is happening right now? Dude, I actually, I'm, I'm, like, I'm actually so confused. I don't know what's going on. I'm about to get kicked off the server right now, though. If this shit does not start moving and responding, then I'm going to definitely be getting, yeah, server. There's no way that server is going down right now, though. There's just no way. This has to be, like, my internet fucking up or something. I don't know what it is. I, oh, yeah, I know. Everyone just now got kicked off the server. What the fuck? Server's going down at a very weird time, so what does that mean? Item store time, that's what it means. So, let's go ahead and see what, what all we got. So, we have the Black Diamond AK that cost four forty nine. Holy shit. Then we got the Blackberry Rock. Okay, okay, I can respect that. Honestly, I might need to buy that rock. I might need to buy the Blackberry Rock. It's kind of nice. Plus, I fuck with Blackberries, too, so. Then you got the chicken costume, silly goose shit. Rock that shit if you're a silly-ass goose. Then you got the cyber hoodie and the cyber pants. Not bad, just, you know, black slash gray. People fuck with that color scheme, people are gonna buy it up, so that'll be that. Then you have the Easter farm door. Not really too much to say about that. That one's for the ladies, all right? So ladies can buy that and be like, oh, it's just so cute. Then you have the hatched chick furnace. Again, this is something that the women are gonna like more than the guys that are that are playing. You know, th this is for the girls that are playing inside their, the, you know, their husband's base, organizing and shit. They're gonna be popping this down, there, and then they're gonna be like, "Hey, honey, come here. Look at this cute furnace." Guys are gonna come over and be like, "Oh yeah, honey, that's nice." But he's he's not serious. He doesn't like it. Then you got the jungle sar. Okay, that, I mean, looks solid, I guess. If you're into like tie dye and shit like that, I mean, that's not tie dye, but it's like. It kind of gives me tie-dye vibes. Uh, then we have Shadowborn Garage Door. Some people are going to buy that up for sure. The people that are like, I roof camp and I'm going to take over the fucking world. And then we have the Solai Armor Door. This door actually looks kind of fucking sick. Holy shit, four bucks though? Eh, I mean... Oh wait, then the other side is red. Pfft. That's interesting. Okay, wow. What a unique armor door. And wait, does it glow? Yeah, it skin glows in the dark. Okay, yeah, that's... That's a pretty crazy looking armored door, I'm not gonna lie. Then we have the stone base box. What are we doing? Okay, then you have the egg suit, which is nothing new, so. So with this shop, I think there's actually gonna be a lot that are gonna sell. Usually I don't give the best ratings on shops, just cause I'm not really into skins in the first place. But, sales wise, I feel like, I feel like the Black Diamond AK is gonna sell despite the shitty price. I feel like the cyber hoodie and pants are gonna sell, this garage door is gonna sell. This armor door is going to sell. Even the small box might sell. I'm going to give this an 8 out of 10 when it comes to sales, okay? Which is pretty rare for me. Uh, but I do feel like this shop's going to sell well with people. For my personal taste, I'll give it like a 6.5 out of 10 for sure. So maybe like a 7 out of 10. But yeah. Let's go ahead and jo uh, join back in the server. I think that it's back up. I don't know what just happened to it though. Oh yeah, so that's right. We're looking for tech trash. Dude, I, I don't know. I thought that I had tech trash still. Yeah. Actually, no, 7. Okay, yeah. There we go. Sorry. Let's go ahead and just make two C4 real quick. And not- what the hell is that? I, like, like, I see this shit over there every single day, and I just think, what in the world is this thing? Like, I'm at 39 FPS, like, dude, the FPS on this server. Look at this freaking thing up here, though, man. What the fuck is this? I've never seen this before. I'm sure that some of you guys have seen similar shit to this. But, uh... Yeah, wow, okay. You look inside of here, and it's just, there's just a staircase in there. Come over here and look up, and I see a shop. And I, 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 like, I don't know, it looks kind of fun to live inside one of these things, but it might get kind of annoying. I mean, like, yeah, like, you could just have staircases like that guy, but I feel like you would want ladder hatches going up constantly. Now I'm seeing this silly goose base right here at the wood doors. Slaughter. Like, you think that says slaughterhouse, but, like, H-O-U. What the fuck is that? A limp dick? Like, that's... Is it an L? Like, what is that little thing right there? What is that? The server actually makes me want to fall asleep. Oh, wait. Oh, my God, dude. I get to fight one human being today, guys. Can you guys believe it? How does that headshot not just fully kill him right there? Listen, sir, I'm sorry for killing you. You did look lower tier, but listen, all right? No one's outside on this server anymore. So, it's like, Tyree, with how much, you know, I respect, uh, you starting from the bottom right now and trying to build up. You have to die, I'm sorry. Alright, so wait, what's his name said that my, my low grade is in the TC next to the oil refinery? Oh, shit. What the? Oh my god, Lily! Look at this guy! This dude is just, like, holy fuck, Lillian.
dude, what is happening? My fucking OBS is lagging. Okay, what the <laughs> Yeah, so I think that I know the two bases that I'm going to be raiding, by the way. Um, I'm going to be raiding this base right here, I think, next. For sure. I have a good feeling about this with the large furnaces and research table outside. And then the other one is, like, over, like, kind of near my base. I think that I had just looked at it a moment ago, but it's, like, behind, like, this hill right here. Do you see? What do we got? Okay, this dude is placing skulls in here, bro. Skulls. I mean, oh, fuck, dude. Hopefully I have enough. Dude, my OBS is lagging. What is happening on this server? This server is actually, like, it's actually, like, it might be the worst server known to man. No, no, no. Hey, what's up? You lagging it all right now? I've been lagging pretty You're good. Up. Yeah, yeah, this, uh, this server seems like it's getting bad as far as the lag. I don't know. Maybe too many, uh, entities or something. Your low yeah. grade's inside the, uh, TC. Oh. Yeah, I just got it. Thank you. 2C4? Uh, ladder, ladder, ladder. Where's my, where's my rope at right there? Yeah, guys, I don't know. I've been dropping a lot of frames, it seems like, throughout this session of me recording, so hopefully it's not too laggy. I don't know where it's coming from. I've been playing on this server constantly, and from my knowledge, I haven't been dropping any frames before this, man. But today, I don't know, man. My FPS is, like, extra terrible. Yeah, let me just look down here. No double door frame, no double door frame. Yeah, okay, this should be pretty simple, I'm thinking. Yeah, so let me just look. Like, okay, still no double door frame. Okay, so he enters in where? Right here. So does he go to the left or the right? Fuck. I'm going to assume the right. So I'm just going to boom right here. Yeah, let's see what all we get inside here. Oh, okay. We may have landed on some juice. I'm seeing a paddle and I am disgusted right now. I do. This is wait. Yeah, this is not bad. 790 sulfur right there. Got these furnaces. All that have had shit cooking in them. Okay, okay. One minute here. We still have to boom into the next wall over. Unfortunately, TC was right here. <sighs> when in all actuality, I could have boomed into the other square and then just picked into the loot room that I just now got into. Right. That's what hurts. Wait, I just not heard someone down here. This dude is inside of his base, I think. Yeah, that guy is home right now. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get inside my base and depot as fast as possible. But truth is, I mean, it's like, I'm thinking about this right now. Like, do I want to finish this raid, though? Because there's another one that I want to do. And it has large furnaces around it, and I feel like it's a better choice. Yeah, let me come back down here real quick. I don't know, did he already seal? No, not yet. Okay. Yeah, so this dude's in here. Sherlin. <laughs> Sherlin, I need you to calm down right now, bucko. Dude, I'm hearing a wood door in there right now. Don't just walk out right now. Yeah, so it's literally just that door and then a wood door. Okay, I'm going to go up top right now, and I'm going to get the shit that I need for this. Okay, well, this is turning into an online raid, but, like, it's like, where, where, Sherlin, where are you in my area? Like, I'm looking around for people constantly, like, okay, where's the PvP? Sherlin, I've never seen you in my life, and you live right next to me, pal. Let me just get up here in Depot, and I got to go down there, and I got to start fucking crafting up this boom real quick, because now I'm, not, I'm actually not going to have to spend as much as I thought, thankfully. If we're fast enough. I, I don't know if he has outside bags. I get the vibe that he doesn't. He seems a little bit inexperienced. Oh no, it's still open down here. <laughs> I, mean, I don't really want to do this because it's hurting me, but you know. Okay. Door's unlocked, by the way, guys. Just so we all know, I am realizing that. Okay. Let me just... Open this. This shit's gonna be solid, I already know. One minute. Let me just... I'm gonna get rid of his bags like that. Oh, yep, a paddle. Yeah, we have paddlers here. We're exterminating some paddlers today, boys. 
Now this is actually going to turn into a good raid. I already know. Like you can just tell. And you have Sacha right here logged out. <laughs> Silly goose Sacha. So wait, so this box over here, 190 GP, a little bit of shit. Okay. Uh, TC has 56 hours of upkeep. Okay, and then we have two lots of boxes over here. So let me uh, <coughs> <coughs> let me grab a tool real quick. Let me also start crafting up this GP. Uh, yeah, let's see what all we got here. Okay, a little bit more stuff. And Dylan, you don't, you don't have a backpack on you right now? What the hell are you doing? Well, kind of, I mean, I forget if it was last episode where I online raided someone. I think that it was. And it was as they were on timer. Or actually, no, he ended up rage quitting. That's what happened. Similar shit's happening today, it looks like. Look inside this box. Some simple bullshit. Okay, TC's all that's left. Some basic stuff. Okay, okay, okay. All that really matters to me at the end of the day is that I wiped out a paddler. That's all. All right. We actually did get some boom in return too, though. So yeah, it wasn't bad. I got a hundred more high qual. Not that I need that. I have like fucking maybe a thousand inside my base. Uh, yeah. Don't be sure that you're taking these paddles to uh, dispose of them. By the way, do not fuck that up. Let's also pick up this tier two bench. You know, I'm just gonna leave this door unlocked for him, just so he takes this base back. It's like I feel mildly bad, but. By the way, don't do not take the paddle into your base. Do not fuck that up, okay? Must go into oblivion. Yeah, I need to make some more explosives now. So, boom, 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 boom. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. I'm just going to take out this. And, yeah, we're going to go and uh, recycle this shit real quick. Then we're going to raid one more base. So, yeah, wait. He said that this shit got raided. So, let me uh look around just real quick. Wait. Oh my god, dude, what is happening? What is this leg? I can't even open the door, like... Okay, we're in here. <laughs> okay, there's still, like, some stuff. Oh my god, the high qual. <coughs> yeah, guys, I'm dropping so many frames over here by this base. Like, the big base here next to, ne next to my shit, so I apologize. I don't know, man, I feel like me dropping frames in my recordings is, like, so rare, but now suddenly it's just happening a shitload today. Not to mention, Lillian just now became a $10 Patreon. <laughs> Dude, Lillian's just like a fan all of a sudden, man. I don't know what it is. He knows who I am now based, like, from people, like, coming over and talking to him and shit that are viewers. And, I don't know, man, he's he's talked highly of some of you guys coming over and just being super chill and nice. So, shout out to you guys. We may have a few stream snipers here and there that are dick faces, but uh, I feel like 99.9% .9 of y'all, great, terrific people, and I really appreciate it. You guys could have came over, talked a lot of shit, built all over his base, and just poked at him constantly, you know? But you didn't do that. You were cool. Okay, then that I'm pretty much all ready to go. Let me just get up top, have a little bit of pumpkins real quick, and then we got a dip. Pumpkins right there. Okay. I do. This guy ended up patching up his base now. But I still got upkeep in that bitch, though. <laughs> okay, so this is already a really weird-ass looking base. So, I see a door back there, door here. Where do I boom? I don't know, I'm in here. Let me actually just look at this real quick. Is there, like, floors in here that like, I can stick this shit off of, or no? I don't think so, Dylan. Oh, wait, no, right there. Right there. That's a fucking loot room right there. There's actually a double door frame here. So there's a door that's behind this door that enters into here. Dude, oh my god, I keep on lagging. I'm gonna boom, like, back here, I think. I think this is gonna be, like, the safest bet. Um, maybe not, I don't know, but I'm just gonna go with the flow here. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, let's see where this goes. What all do we got here, huh? Okay, it was the wrong spot. Dil Dylan, Dylan, Dylan. <laughs> like, it, TC has to be right here. It has to be behind this. I just, I don't know what's, uh, Dylan, just go home and just make the boom. There's no... There's no th saying, oh, I wonder what's going to be in the... Nah, go back home, raid the fuck in there, get it over with, all right? I mean, fuck, for that base having two large furnaces outside of it, I would think that it would be something better than that, than just an empty fucking one by 2 right there. Fuck, man, I'm, a I I'm, like, I'm actually pissed that I missed the oil rig counter today when someone started taking it. I was checking my cams earlier on throughout the day, but then just right in the middle of the day when I'm not paying attention, boom. I just look at the map and the crate's gone. Dude, and I'm seeing drop frames again. What is happening? This is actually, like, really, really bad. I, I, like, I'm, I feel like I dropped a lot of frames this session now, which really sucks to say. A minute. So, yeah, pretty much. Let me just go, like, uh... Okay. That better not kill me, game, I swear. 
Thank you. Okay, okay. Well, I mean, eh. There's some boxes here, which is like, okay, 300 crude oil. Some bullshit. <laughs> Got the chicken suit. Wait, egg vision plus one? That's interesting. 430 sulfur. Three pure Ortiz. Like, what is this loot? What is the story behind this base? Let me come over here and check out the TC real quick. Just full of stone. Okay, this is too much stone. I'm getting too much stone from these raids, man. It is around that time that I usually get off. I think that tomorrow I'm going to be switching servers, though. This server is getting too laggy, and there's not enough happening in my area, like, continuously now. I mean, tomorrow's the start of the weekend, so it would probably improve a little bit, but I, I feel like we should just ride out the rest of uh, this wipe just on, like, just random high pop servers. Maybe come out with a couple modded videos or something like that. Change things up. I feel like that's what we should do, so. I'll see you tomorrow for a new day. I'm going to give Lillian my, my farewells, so... But yeah, I'll see you in the next one. We have a really cool update coming to this game soon that's going to be changing some uh, shit up at Oil Rig, which is going to be really, really interesting. I'm excited to see how all that plays out, man. Should be, should be, should be pretty cool, so. I'm actually hearing turrets go off down there right now. Yeah, I'm going to end up messaging uh, Lillian and telling him that this is probably my last day on here and that it was fun. And yeah, uh, shout out to him being chill the whole time as well. So, uh, if you're here to the end of this video, though, comment the word oil, and I will see you in the next one, my friend. Uh, yeah, bye. Peace.